You know, I wanted to leave it while the contract is there, dear, but this is just totally unacceptable. Right? Take a look at the condition. Okay? And this is where, like, you know, this is where children play. And, you know, like, what type of safety mechanism does these contractors abide by? And, you know, like, look at this here. Kids can just squeeze right through that. And look at the litter. This is from the work. There's even a baby bottle here, too. Imagine that, eh? And this is from the contract work. That looks like a dead body. Could it be? It better not be a dead body. Could the contractors be storing them? Like, this is not. This should be a lot more cleaner and a lot more safety-oriented. And if you look around, there's more litter. So, and there's like, these are all the asbestos that are coming off the window. And you need more care about uh, tenants' health and safety from the contractor work that's being done here. And we do ask the city to look into it. Right, it's pretty difficult for this man to operate his garden, which is such a good thing for the community in this state. And also, now that we're talking about the garden, this contract work was supposed to be done, I think this individual was told it was going to be finished three, four weeks ago. And they would have been able to extend the garden. And this is a children's garden, right? So we have to make sure that when contractors are given jobs, that they're looking out for the health and the safety of the tenants, not just making a salary. And this is not proper.